What is going on guys, this is Ben here. In today's video, we are going to be covering more news for the update. I'm sure some of you have probably already seen this, but I'm going to give my thoughts on them. Uh, Clash Royale tweeted out some more sneak peeks, and if you guys remember, the balance changes are coming out December 11th, which is tomorrow, aka Monday. So expect a Clash Royale update tomorrow, and hopefully we have some more cool things that we discover tomorrow that are going to be in the update. So, for the sneak peeks that we got today, uh, we got another new card thing, or a, on, on their Twitter they said new card coming. I'll throw the picture right here, and it's basically just like little cannonballs, or it looks like you guys know like old style um, like guns, how they would shoot these kind of like projectiles out of the gun. So I feel as though maybe it's connected with that character that we saw yesterday um, in the like App Store leak. If you did, if you guys did not see my video uh, yesterday talking about like the other new card that might be released and like the app store leak of the cards check it out that'll be in the description below but yeah i feel as though this has to tie in with him kind of like the hunter guy and i'll throw up the picture right here too uh so yeah i feel as though that card ties in with that and then maybe the remote controls with the mini little sparky thing if we want to call it that but then also the next sneak peek is a new arena so as you can see it's a little bit electric and I've, I like the theme here. I've, I assume they're probably going to put some like that mini... I, okay, first off, let's start this. The new arena, I, I, I feel, is going to fall into probably like 34 or 3,500 trophies. Because you, you see we have Hog Mountain at 3,000. And then it's a big jump up to Legendary Arena at 3,800. So I, I, I'm thinking probably 3,400 trophies would be like maybe whatever this new arena is. It could be like Electric Arena. It could be tesla arena i don't know because it, it, with the electrical wires that it's showing i feel as though it has to be something with electric electricity obviously and then one of the new cards is that little mini sparky that little remote control mini sparky thing so i'm feeling that card will probably be released there what's odd though is they're making a new arena and we still don't have any legendary arena cards for themselves uh we just recently got a lot of the hog mountain cards but hey new arena i'll take it so that stuff expect the update tomorrow guys so definitely leave a like if you guys are excited for that subscribe if you have not already hit the bell notification because guys if we get new cards early i'm definitely going to be making max and out videos trying to get as much gameplay on them as possible if we can even unlock them and just go over all the update stuff tomorrow i might even stay up all night to see when we do get it but guys without further ado we also are going to be opening up our clan chest today have not done that yet this weekend uh shout out to danny xc getting 271 xiv getting 240 and big banana Winky Face getting 129 and then King Q or King K, sorry, getting 99. So shout out to all them. Uh, my combined with all my accounts, I don't even know what I got. I got 24 on this one. I think I got 20 on another one. Benton one noob got 20, and then my level one, the hardest one to get crowns on, I got six. So I did all right. Uh, let's see if we can get. A le We're gonna open up three crown chests. So stay tuned throughout the video. We'll have to hop onto different accounts and trophy push a little bit. Hopefully we can get a legendary. Sadly, we cannot. I actually probably should have saved that crown chest for this account. Just thinking, because uh, if new cards come on, I'm going to need all the chests that I can get. Quest, we're getting close to this magical chest one, so that's all right. But we're doing okay trophy pushing. I am still using the Music Masters Battle Deck right here. Uh, but we will hop on the level 11 count, open up some more uh, crown chest very soon. Uh, basically, I'm going to ask you guys a few questions here. One, did you get anything good out of your clan chest? Uh, hopefully you did. Maybe you got a legendary or legendary or legendary. Uh, I was gonna say maybe you got a legendary out of this legendary chest, but it's not a legendary chest. Maybe you got a. Hopefully you got a legendary out of your. Uh, uh, I'm getting so mixed up on this. I was gonna say clan battle chest now. Out of your clan chest, okay, Ben. Hopefully you got a legendary. And then let me know what you guys think of the uh, the update stuff. Are you excited for the new things? Um, honestly, they kind of just leaked or not leaked, but they gave sneak peeks on cards um balance changes and an arena so good things and quality of life things probably but i would love to see like something maybe like super game changing they already had balance changes that were super like gonna change up the meta i, I guess you could say that's game changing uh but i would love to see like maybe like a new card rarity some cool more game modes and maybe tomorrow we will discover that uh and everything so stay tuned for that but this is gonna be a tough push for me to defend here um We'll see what happens. I got the cannon cart going. I got the flying machine. Uh, the baby dragon is going off in the back there. I'm probably going to end up losing this tower. But as long as I don't get three crowned, I guess we're going to be okay. So the golden push, I guess what could have been maybe better was throw on the mega knight instead. But it was the air troops that were literally dominating. So strong opening push by Messer here. Uh, usually, I face kind of like hog riders and stuff like that. And this battle like, is solid with it. The golem... Obviously, it was a little bit tricky there. Didn't have the best 
of uh, defenses and everything. I think I might have overextended with my poison a little bit, so that was rough. But I'm going to try and get a furnace down. I'll leave his elixir collector alone this time. Uh, I'm going to be excited for the balance changes, though, man. It's going to shake up the meta so much. Going to have to be on top of everything. But okay, he's going to be throwing on the golem here. Now, this is a tricky, a tricky situation. Do I want to play, like, just go all defensive? I think I have to. Like, I got to throw the Mega Knight in the back. Got to get enough elixir, throw on a cannon cart, and get enough for the poison to take care of all the air units and air troops and everything. So, this is going to be a little tricky. The log coming out. Okay. So, we got our Mega Knight. Here's going to be the poison. I I, I don't I, I can't think of a better time to use it than right now. So, we got the bats coming too. He might tornado. He might not. There is the tornado right there. So hopefully we just keep if we can keep this tower alive, we'll be in a much better situation. Uh, we do still have our cannon cart. Maybe get in range. Nope, he logged it. Okay. Well, if he throws down a golem, we're gonna aggressively push the other side with our Mega Knight. So we'll throw on our another furnace. Golem, and we'll see what happens. We have to go in here. This is our one shot to try and maybe get a quick tower. He might throw down the Night Witch. Don't exactly know. But if he's gonna allow me to push this side. I'm gonna be okay and I'm probably gonna try and just go for a three crown over here because that's all I really have it's basically our base race right now this is my lone shot to go they're on a goblin hut too because why not get some goblins going uh, the cannon cart as well they're on the poison we got the cannon cart still going the bat the flying machine needs to get some more damage oh that's what happens when you record sometimes you don't realize the time <laughs> oh my god I didn't realize the the game was over there. Well, that's embarrassing. I, I, I for sure thought we had more time. Well, my bad, guys. I didn't play that one super well, so... We'll take a step back here. The golem dominated us, for sure. I think that first push really do, like did me in for it because I dropped my spawners down. And the battle like, thrives when you can get those spawners down and keep them going. I think I just overexpended too much elixir and tried to set that stuff up and then I used the poison and I couldn't really counter the golem push. Maybe if I would've thrown the Mega Knight, it would've been a little bit different, but he had so much air troops. He had the bats from the Night Witch, Mega Minion and all that stuff. So it was not fun for us, but all right. We'll see if we can get a crown chest legendary maybe. Oh, this is a good sign. We got a lot of cards here. It's still boosted, that's why. I still have my boost going. Okay, I was wondering. Sadly, no legendary, no boosted legendary, but that's fine. How long do I have left of my boost? My boost is over though. Okay, maybe I still had it when I got my crown chest. I think maybe that's what it is. Cause like, yeah, the boost was over, but I'll definitely buy this. We got enough gold for it. I can be able to upgrade that now if I do decide to use it. And I have two silver chests open, so it is what it is. I honestly don't even know what battle deck I'm using on this account. Okay, it's like a, a P.E.K.K.A. with minion hordes and hog rider. Okay, we'll try that out. We got our clan chest though. We have one more clan chest after this. We'll see if we can get a legendary. No. No legendary out of this one, so we have one more chance to get that legendary out of the clan chest. Epic Sunday. Um, I kind of want to save my request, because what if the new cards is an epic? So we'll save that epic Sunday, because that stays with me until I actually do it once. So we'll save that for now. We are still kind of low. We're still at 4,000 trophies from the reset, so nothing too crazy. But I, guys, I'm just really excited. Balance changes, change of meta tomorrow, and, excited, or, and update tomorrow. That's the most hyped I've been in a while for Clash Royale. Because I'm not gonna lie, you guys remember like uh, October, the update was a little bit disappointing after like Touchdown left us because it kind of left us with nothing else to do, really. And it was all the same. Uh, hopefully he doesn't have a mirror because he just wasted his arrows. See what he has for our minion. He probably has like a zap or something. If not, he's gonna let that go to the tower? Okay. But now I don't really have a counter for these elite barbarians just yet because my P.E.K.K.A. is not on rotation. We'll try and get the drop down. Hopefully I don't lose the tower. Okay, there we go. We're good. So, sadly our minion horde I thought was going to get more damage than that, to be completely honest. But we'll throw on the bandit here. Um, if he has like a skeleton army, I have the zap ready. See what happens. Maybe he just has no elixir. I don't really know, but I'm, I want my bandit to survive. So, we'll keep that alive. is going to take care of that Inferno Tower easily. I'm just really low on elixir at this moment in time. So, I can't really... I can't really... I need to like basically save up. Because he has those elite barbarians... Uh, I don't, I'll worry about that 141 damage on that tower a little bit later. I think I'll be fine, but I just need to save up Elixir at this moment. Um, this could be a risky hog rider, but I'm going to do it. See what he has. Probably he might throw down the elite barbarians, but... Oh, interesting. Interesting. I do not recommend that. Maybe he just has... Oh, I think he's doing, trying to do a trick goblin barrel there. Maybe he just has a super heavy battle deck. I do not know. But we're going in here with... 
He didn't, he didn't, he did not use the arrows yet. So, we'll throw on the Electro Wizard over here. I'm saving my P.E.K.K.A. just for the Elite Barbarians. Um, I could throw on the Bandit if I really want to. Because like I said, I, I do need to worry about this tower, but not... Okay, at least, that makes it easy. Electro Wizard already took care of it. So, now we're okay. Um, I, I'm kind of sitting on Elixir. I, I'll zap these because I don't really know. Hog Rider... See if we can bait, well, we're not really baiting the arrows, but we'll see if we can get the arrows out. And then we'll throw it on here. And then now I'm going to start my packet push. My tower is pretty much already dead. If he wants to Elite Barbarian rush me, I'm kind of prepared. But if he, he'll, he'll probably drop the Elite Barbarians on my left-hand side tower. Or not, he'll go straight in with my right-hand side tower. That kind of helps out. I'll keep throwing on the zap here, so why not? Um, and plus, if he wants to throw on the Inferno tower, I have my Electro Wizards. That's kind of, it was okay to throw on the zap, but... We'll see what we can do here. Um, have to get the Electro Wizard in here. Zap that Inferno Tower. We'll throw on another Bandit. I'm going to preempt the arrows, just in case he throws on that, uh, that Goblin Gang. And if he wants to throw on his Goblin Barrel, that's cool. I'll have a Zap ready for it, so I think we're okay. So, pretty easy for us. Nothing too crazy. I don't think he's going to... I don't think he's going <laughs> to worry too much, but... Alright, I got the tower. Now, I'm going to have to go on that level 1 account, guys. So bear with me. We almost got the... We almost, almost got that challenge, but... Or quest, not challenge. I'm losing my... I'm losing, like, my thoughts here, man. Oh, I'm out, of, I'm out of gems. Dude, this is, like, the lowest I've ever had my gems in a very long time. I only have seven gems. You guys know me. I like to gem a lot, and that's... That usually never happens. That's saying, Clash Royale, get some cards, so it forces me to buy gems. Or not forces me, but I can so I can do some gem sprees and get some... Max new cards, because that's what I want, but it wouldn't be on this account, actually. It would be on my main account. But other than that, guys, we'll head to level one. Take our free epic on this account. Uh, sadly, no legendaries. I don't remember the last time I really had legendaries on this account, but never, never doesn't really matter. I mean, yes, it would be nice to get the legendaries in the shop, but I changed my mind. I'm probably going to keep this level one for a long while. I don't know if I would ever want to max it out, but it would, be, it would be nice to get legendaries in the shop. I mean, I still do. It's just a lot of times I'm maybe not on, or like I don't check it that day when I would get it. So it seems as though I'm not getting them at a super fast rate. But hopefully we get a legendary out of the clan chest. We came in clutch before. We just need epics here. Ah, uh, so dud clan chest all around today. Hopefully you guys had better luck than I did. Uh, we'll do a 2v2. I'll do a quick match. I don't know if anyone in the clan is on, but this is going to be a struggle. They're, they got five levels on us already. Sergio. Hopefully our battle decks mesh well, and sadly I do not have a log or anything, and neither does he, so that's a little bit unfortunate. And I'm going to go with the Lumberjack, he's going to go with the Hog Rider. They're going to throw down a Golem, oh my goodness, and a Mega Knight, okay. Well, I don't really have a whole lot of air troops to slow down this Mega Knight. Uh, I guess I'm going to have to throw my own Mega Knight on top of theirs, and I'll wait till that Wizard crosses, because why not, but what do you got for me, Sergio? He's going to Fireball. Okay, well that's going to take care of the Mega Knight. Golem, still alive, sadly, but our Mega Knight, that was not a smart, not a smart Goblin Gang whatsoever, but I'm going to throw on the Inferno Tower, or the Inferno Dragon here, um, just hopefully we don't get three crowns, hopefully we can at least make it into Double Elixir and see what happens, because he has the Hog Rider, he does have an Inferno Tower as well, so we just got extremely unlucky not having our big tank destroyers on the top of our battle deck, which seems to happen quite often, but... We can't all blame that on. We can't blame that all on luck. We'll just blame it on our level. How does that sound? So princess going. Let's see if they want to take care of her. I don't really know if they will. I mean, they, they possibly could. But I'll throw on the bandit just to keep her alive. So we can because we still have to take this tower on this push or take that tower on some push here. So um, not no. Nah, I'm not gonna keep her alive on this. We'll we'll let her go. Uh, I guess I'll throw on the lumberjack again though. I mean, why not? Oh. My goodness. Well, we both wasted our logs, so hopefully Hog Rider, Hog Rider didn't even get to the tower. Well, um, I don't, I, hopefully they don't have a lot of minions. I know those fire spirits are coming, but I don't really have anything else to drop at this moment. So, we're kind of forced to do this, and I think we're going to get three crown. This is going to be a devastating level one cannot pull off the upset here. Throw it on the bandit. I don't have my log. We'll try and keep it alive for now. I mean, the wizard's just going ham. We have no way to take it out. So, 
We couldn't pull off the upsets. A lot of losses today. That sucks. The main account trophy pushing didn't go so well. Sergio and I did not do so well, but the levels killed us. Like I said, usually I have to have my clanmates on there because they know what they're getting themselves into when they play the level one. But it's so hard to even get crowns. I'm not saying we lose all the time, but see, Spider Freak was like my only win and a lot of defeats. It's very, very hard. Very, 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 very hard. So, with that, hope you guys enjoy the video. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Uh, tomorrow, if the update, I, I'm just speculating, but you guys, usually when the balance changes go live, you know the new update's gonna go live with it. Um, so, update tomorrow, I'll cover all of that. Hopefully I get some wins tomorrow. Pretty rough day today on the ladder, but on that, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and I'll see you guys later.